reflect the opinions of the staff or management of visionary related entertainment. Oh. Aloha, and welcome to Betty's Real Estate Corner, brought to you by Caldwell Banker, Sakamoto Properties. Roy and Betty Sakamoto here in the studio. Meyer Computer here with us, recording this so that it can be on our website. So check out our website, sakamotoproperties.com, and look around for it. Or Actually, I've Googled it a couple of times, looking for KAOI Radio, Betty's Real Estate Corner, and it's kind of fun because I bring up some of the old ones that I've forgotten, but it really is fun to listen to them for me, uh, and I hope it is for you. So today, we've got a lot of different thoughts going on. We've got Dr. Norm Esten checking in again about COVID and, ex- and everything that's going on today, and I think he's really got some interesting things to report because I, our statistics are changing And we've all got to, again, start paying attention and do the right thing, at least do the right thing for yourself. Make it happen and think that it's not just about you. It's about a way, way bigger picture. So Roy is here. He's brought a lot of information for us to share with you. And, uh, oh, and Holly Makua. Today is the 75th anniversary, or we're in that. Yeah, Yeah, we're in that period. 75th anniversary of Holly Makua which, as most of you know, the nursing homes here, and they started during World War II, uh, basically by somewhat the Buddhist church that was trying to find places for the frail and elderly of Maui that needed assistance at that time because the hospital was used for servicemen. But right now, you've got the website, Roy. Tell them a little more about what's going on for some fundraising right now. Well, there's a a great silent auction going on. It's uh, in celebration of our 75th anniversary at uh, Halimakua. And uh, if you go to halimakua.org, halimakua.org, you'll see a uh, a link to the auction site. And... uh, some of the items are, are fantastic. There's uh, two rounds of golf on the Kai course in Kaanapali. Uh, value is $410, and uh, it's up for bid right now. There's uh, Island Art Party class, uh, value at $59 that you can bid on. A bounty music card, value of $60. So go to halimakua.org, and you've got a few more Well, wait, here's one here. that I think is really worth doing. Marco's Grill and Deli in Kahului. Everybody knows where that is. They have a $100 gift card. Now, here's the really good news is that there's a current bid on it for $95, but you've got a great restaurant there, restaurant there and you're making a donation. So it would be really fun to see of these See, some of these go over the asking price. There's one uh, $125 gift certificate to Merriman's at Kapalua. Again, they're bidding these up pretty quickly, so I think that's a fabulous thing for any charity, and I know we all look at it and try to come up with a really great deal in there, and I think there still are some really great deals. No, and and some fun stuff. There's a $25 gift certificate to Polly's Mexican Restaurant. There's a, uh, a $78 value for Puka Perry gold-filled Puka Hoop earrings. Um, it's, uh, in fact, there's two of those. Sam Sato's gift yeah. card. Yeah. Here's a great one. Uh, Ocean View Room at the Four Seasons Resort, plus $250 dining credit at Duo Steak and Seafood. Value on this is $1,512. Sunset sale for two on the Trilogy. Yeah. That would be great. We've done that. It's really pretty fun. A $50 gift certificate to Rainbow Acres Cactus and Succulent Nursery. A $50 gift certificate there. And uh, maybe we should bid on that Sam Santos. I think we (laughs) should. That would be fun. Or wait, $70 Island Grocery gift card. The owners there are absolutely the most spectacular people, and everybody should shop at Island Grocery. It's really, really great. 
Uh, but it is a place really island friendly. They've got a lot of hard to find specialty type items, national branded grocery items also. But check that out at some time. But for right now, there is bidding on a $70 gift card. So check that one out. There's jewelry that's on here. There's really yeah, some fun that's things. That's a great one, a $250 gift certificate to Maui Divers. Uh, current bid is only $120 right now. So get your bid in on, on uh, all of these items. But here's another really nice one. There's a resident art from Halimakua, and there's one called Nature's Innovation. It looks really great. And it says, own a priceless piece of art created by one of Halimakua's residences, residents, excuse me, uh, acrylic on canvas. Take a look at it. And I think it is something that is beautiful and would be worth having and framing and having it for any home. So again, take a look, halimakua.org, give it a shot, and let's all get it, the bidding happening. You never know when your family will be the one that needs Halimakua. We were in that position a long time ago now when Roy's mom was sick, and the outcome of that, which I, he may know the year, but a long time ago, and she's passed away since. But they took such fabulous care of her that Roy ended up starting to do a lot of work for them, got a great golf tournament, was the senior, seniors golf tournament in Kanapali, and that really was great for Holly Makua. Uh, Roy... And myself, we really worked hard at getting a lot of people to help with Holly Makua and make good contributions over the years. But it is a fabulous nursing home, and you never know when somebody you know might need some assistance, and they'll get them healthy, get them out of there, get them well. So help Holly Makua. And Roy now has been on the board for probably the better part or more than 40 years. Not quite. Maybe 30. Well, I think it's more. Yeah. He's just Here, being here's another. No, here's another priceless uh, piece of art. Uh, it's titled Magical Sunset. Oh, that's fabulous. Isn't that great? Yes. It's um, foot, uh, uh, painted by Futoshi Otoma. She's a Halimakua uh, resident. And uh, you've got a hit on our website, halimakua.org. Get to the website for the auction, and it's... Um, it's a great time to put in a bid. It's a fantastic piece of art. Homemade bakery gift certificate. And now we better stop this. Think about some real estate, or we're going to have Norm Eston checking <laughs> in soon. So we better think about all of the different things going on right now. One of the things I want to talk about as we start thinking properties, we have a new listing at the Ridge at Kapalua. And keep in mind, very few listings. I mean, I think there, if there's two right now, including this one, it's a lot. So it's a one-bedroom, two-bath, really great golf course, ocean view. It's really a spectacular unit. It's in excellent condition. It's Roy's got a lot of yeah, the information, it's, it's, too. It's a ground floor. It's one of the few that you can uh, access directly from the parking lot. There's no uh, step-ups or step-downs. Um, it's fantastic. It's a, a one-bedroom, two-bath at the Ridge. Apartment number is 2312. The first owner, think about that one, is Hal Irwin. And Hal Irwin was uh, Kapalua's touring pro at the time of construction. So, again, he had the choice of any unit that he wanted, and that's what he chose. But now I hear, I think we've got Norm Eston on, so we're going to put him on here and hear what he's got to say. Aloha, Norm. Hi, Norm. Hey, aloha. Oh, whoa, Good okay. <laughs> Good to hear your voice. We're, we've been talking Likewise. about your checking in with us, and so we've kind of let whoever's listening know that you're going to check and give us an up-to-date on why we've really got to get moving and get vaccinated. Terrific. Great. Nice to check in with you. Um, what we're seeing now, this is kind of an up-to-date for what's happening here on Maui in the state around the country and around the world is uh, we're once again seeing, unfortunately, the number of coronavirus cases uh, rise pretty much everywhere in the United States, um, and anywhere between 15 percent and 50 percent more than they were a few weeks ago uh, in every state. Um, states with low vaccination rates like Arkansas, Missouri, Louisiana, Nevada, much less. 
uh, and they've had less of vaccination rate and they're having even more cases. And some of those hospitals are filling up and um, the ICUs are full and running out of ventilators. We don't have that problem here yet, but we are seeing um, more cases than we have been. And uh, many of them are this new Delta variant. Again, uh, this isn't a more severe version in terms of being more dangerous in terms of what it does to you, but it spreads more rapidly. So uh, people get sick a lot easier uh, with it. Um, right now, the vaccinations that are available will protect you against this variant as well as the other variants that are out there. <clears throat> and more of them are coming up all the time as the virus evolves around the world. Uh, but the vaccines now will protect you against uh, these new variants as well as the standard ones that we had earlier in the year. And um, the great thing about it is if you get vaccinated, um, you have almost a zero percent of catching um, COVID uh, at all. Uh, and if you do, the data are that you won't die for sure. So it protects you against dying. And more importantly, it protects you pretty much for, against the long COVID or the long acting version of the virus. And we now, now know that <clears throat> about a third of the people that come down with COVID will have symptoms for a long, long time, many years, and probably forever, some kind of neurological symptom, brain fog, uh, or in any of the long COVID variants that you've heard about on the news. So that's what we want to protect people against. So the bottom line for uh, the listeners is, um, if you've already had your vaccination and completed the whole course, if you have the two-course vaccine, you are safe. You can uh, cross your fingers and count yourself as being very, very fortunate and lucky. Uh, you may or may not need a booster in a few months. Who knows? But if you know anybody who hasn't been vaccinated yet, now's the time to say, hey, this is the time to get moving because we, these cases are again on the rise. And um, <clears throat> we want to prevent these from becoming full-fledged outbreaks. You know, Norm, another really important thing for people to remember is it's not just about them. It's about everybody that they love near them and about everybody in Maui in the world. And it is a worldwide thing. And as much as we're a small island, if we can take care of our island and others take care of their places, we're all helping the world. It's a, it's a worldwide virus. Well, I think that's uh, absolutely the point, like with most public health things, and uh, especially something that's a respiratory, in other words, spread through the air like this. And uh, none of us uh, are safe and protected unless all of us are, uh, especially with something new like this. Um, and it's the same thing with what we saw in the world with polio and smallpox. Unless we're all protected, uh, none of us are individually. So it's going to be the same thing here. The faster we can get to it, the better. Um, it's unfortunately been uh, slower to be accepted than other uh, vaccinations in the past. Uh, and it doesn't really make sense. There's, there's no doctor or scientist who can really understand why it hasn't been accepted because it's been uh, such a well-tested and such a safe vaccination. So um, I'd encourage anybody out there who knows somebody uh, who hasn't gotten one to go to your doctor, go to Maui Health, which is the hospital, or any of the pharmacies, CVS or, or, or Walgreens will have this, or any of our doctors on call. Doctors offices. on call. Where are and, they located uh, now, get, Norm? Get the, Get that vaccine. Would you give us a quick note on, there's your Kanapali office, which is located where the Times Supermarket is. Do you still have the Hyatt office some of the time? Some of the time, but uh, it's mostly the Times facility. And then if you're on the uh, south side, um, uh, where, the where Wailea? The brand new facility mm -hmm. at uh, the shops of Wailea, and anybody can go in there and uh, get a vaccine. Again, it's free and covered by your insurance. And if uh, you don't have a current insurance plan, uh, it's uh, complimentary. There's no charge for it at all. And again, if you have a Kaiser plan, Kaiser will do it. If you have another uh, health care facility or doctor you go to, uh, they should be able to get it to you as uh, will any pharmacy. Super. So I guess then we got that covered for today, Dr. Norm. Thank you so much for calling in. Thanks, Norm. All right, we will keep you posted. Okay. Thank you again. And See aloha. you soon. Aloha. Bye-bye. Bye. So back to a little real estate yeah, or back to Holly Makua? Great of Norm to, to give us an update, though. It's, um, it's he fantastic. He yeah. really single-handedly brought a lot of vaccinations and a lot of comfort to the people of Maui. You no know, question. He's been Absolutely. on yeah. 
uh, computers and television and newspapers, and he's really individually stepped up and done everything he can to help us all get through this problem that we've got. And again, it's a worldwide problem, so let's all do our share, whatever it takes. Yeah, and it's interesting. You know, the Olympics is starting next week, and uh, obviously a lot of trouble over there in Tokyo. Uh, Some of the athletes are not going because of uh, previous instances of COVID uh, or fear of getting COVID. So it's going to be an interesting Olympics coming up. But they'll still be Olympic champions for 2021. Oh, yeah. They'll still have their gold medals and, and they'll silver have their gold and medals. Yeah. Hey, a quick back to 2312 at the Ridge, yeah. if you don't mind. No. It's... I, I just feel like it's something, if somebody's looking for a Kapalua condo, it's a great value and it's one of the best locations. And again, keep in mind in the early days when Hal Irwin had an opportunity, one of the top golfers of all time, to buy whatever he wanted, he chose. 2312 at the Ridge, and he and his family kept that for many, many years until we were selling it for them, and ironically, we found all sorts of stuff that they had in a storage locker, which we were going to ship to them, until we reminded them that their kids who were in high school, it was basically things like their little cars and play toys. Wasn't there a wagon? There was a dump truck. A small dump truck. A small plastic dump truck. So we that, finally uh, realized, yeah. didn't need to. Uh-uh. Anyway. But Hill Irwin, for you golfers out there, you'll know that uh, he's one of the best golfers in history. A uh, good friend of ours. Uh, really, really nice family man. Great guy. And uh, used to represent Kapalua on the PGA Tour for, oh, quite a few years. Yeah, quite a few years. He's an amazing, amazing man. He's won the U.S. Open a couple of times. A couple of times, yeah. Yeah. Anyway, so again, anyway, yeah. 2312 is what we're really talking at the Ridge. about. Uh, give me a call, Roy at 870-7060 or Betty at 870-7062 or call your favorite realtor and uh, tell him or her that uh, you wanted to see Ridge 2312 and to contact the Sakamoto's and uh, we'll make it easy for them to show. The listing went live, I believe, yesterday. A couple of days ago. A couple of days ago. We're already showing it, and I've got to believe that we're going to have some offers pretty quickly, just because that's the way it's going. It'll be a great rental unit for someone, a perfect home, and for anybody with any difficulty getting around, it's one of the few units at the Ridge, one or two bedroom, that has zero stairs. You can walk out on the golf course side and have no stairs. You can enter with no stairs. It's really spectacular, and that does matter today to a lot of people. Oh, totally. Absolutely. So again, call Roy or Betty, Roy at 870-7060, Betty 870-7062, and uh, tell us you'd like to see Ridge 2312. That's actual. I mean... To check with us about the Ridge or anything at Kapalua, because we are available to fill you in on the history of Kapalua, fill you in on what's on the market now, et cetera, and, um, and just understanding the market in general. And we can help you. Anybody looking for an owner-occupant property, you should still be thinking about buying. It's going to be difficult. We're all going to be trying to find properties for people. But because the interest rate is still so great, and I was talking to uh, my daughter today, who's in the real, est- real estate mortgage business, and she was saying, you know, the thing everyone also has to remember, which is great, is that it's not just about getting your home. It's about how it's going to work in the future. You could invest your money in many, many things, but all you have is a sheet of paper at the end of a month. Here, you're going to have something that you're going to own, and for whatever it's worth, at the end of 30 years, it'll be paid in full maybe 15 years if you're able to do that. But the thing is, you'll pay right now less money in rent. It's a pretty good chance, depending on what you're buying. And it really makes a lot of sense. We can help you talk to lenders. We can help you figure out the market. We have agents that are waiting and that we can get a call to them immediately so that somebody can talk to you quickly. There are a lot of tax advantages, too. So, uh Whatever you're paying in rent, uh, if you compare it to paying for a mortgage, 
You take your mortgage deductions, uh, interest, property taxes. Uh, you, I think you'll be way ahead compared to just paying rent. So, um, again, you know, buy, buy, buy. You've got to buy. It makes Here, sense. Yeah, here's a great one that's uh, a, a first-time homeowner, I'm sure, will jump on this. It's a Kahana Manor, one bedroom, one bath in Kahana, uh, Kahana uh, between Kahana Pali and Kapalua. Uh, it's a one bedroom, one bath, listed at 499000 Great price. It's listed by Rick Kepler from our office. You can reach uh, Rick at 283-3729, 283-3729. This is for Kahana Manor. Unit number is 313-313. Another property, this is going totally in the opposite direction from that. It's located at 6291 Hono Apialani Road. It's listed at $9.9 million, oceanfront, 3.5 acres, a house basically under just under 5,000 square feet. Fabulous property for someone that's thinking in that range and so one of a kind. So call us if that's in your wheelhouse, and we can have you see that. So just give us a call. Again, you've got the numbers, or you can find us, SockMotorProperties.com, and you'll find the property on there, as you'll find all of these properties on that website. So, that's, Yeah, that's a really rare property, to have that kind of acreage, oceanfront, um, adjacent basically to a, a beach that the locals call Slaughterhouse. Um, steps from Honlua Bay. All you surfers will know Honlua Bay. So it's a fantastic piece of property. And just adjacent to the Kapalua Resort. Technically, it's not Kapalua, uh, but there's a. I mean, but you'll still be totally a part of the resort. So it's it's going to be a pretty exciting property for whoever buys it now for the what's, new buyer. What's cool is it has its own well too. And it has its own well. Yeah. We're down to the almost the two-minute warning, so we've got to start paying attention to our timing. But again, check out the halimakua.org and find the the website that we're talking about. It's a benefit they, for Halimakua, and it's celebrating our 75th anniversary of Halimakua. So uh, get on that website, halimakua.org. Hit on the link to the auction site and uh, and bid on some great stuff. And whatever you bid on, even if you pay more than it's worth, just go for it. You're making a contribution to Halimakua. Everything's been donated. It's And again, each one of you, so many people on Maui know someone that's been affected by Halimakua. And their family member has been totally taken care of there. And again, it's not like you go there and you're not going to leave. Many, many people will get well and they'll be back to their life fairly quickly. And if it does become your residence, it's a happy, happy place. We've spent many hours there talking to people. It's spectacular. Yeah, and it's not only a nursing home. There's uh, other facets of Halimakua. There's day health. There's home health. Uh, so uh, we do a lot of rehab there also for people that have had strokes, uh, heart attacks, car accidents, uh, even babies as, as young as a few months old. Yeah. have been uh, residents there, temporary residents of Halimakua. Another quick thing, this kind of is a little self-serving, but I want to say this is one of the things that most people should real estate uh, should understand about real estate brokers. We do all do a lot of things other than selling real estate. Roy's been on that board for so long, and so many realtors. I've been with the Lahaina Luna High School Foundation for a lengthy period of time, and we all care about our community. We care about everybody. And it takes We're a village. Back, it takes a village. You're back yep. to Danny Couch and I love Hawaii. And for whatever it's worth, I love Hawaii. We all love Hawaii. Aloha. Aloha. See you again. K-A-O-I. Aloha. Aloha.